What's up and back? This segment, I'll tell you about a book, I, a short story I just wrote called On the Run. This is one of my favorite short stories. It's really about, um, well, you're going to see. It's, 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 it's what happens like when you get the concept of a ghost. And you know, different people try to get rid of the ghost. It doesn't work. Then the ghost goes up against a real magician. What happens? It was fun to write. Um, it's part of my short stories that I'm going to have some short stories that are mostly just for Amazon. So when you look at the link of the page, it's going to take you to Amazon to, instead of my website. For the Amazon audience, I'm going to treat them a little bit different. Um, but it's cool. I, I really enjoyed it. In a sense, the source of Supreme of the Ohm universe, Dr. Lipton, sort of makes it, or Paul Snyder, sort of makes an appearance, first appearance. So I like it. It's ha I'm, I'm really was fast by the story came out. You know, it's part of the short story. So 99 cents on Amazon. Made it nice and cheap for a lot of you guys. It's, in a sense, kind of what I want to do with horror in a way where, with the way I do horror, I want to make more proactive horror where the person, like normally horror, the humans are the victims, right? My horror, I want to see it either from the spirit standpoint or humans in control of the situation to extent, you know, maybe a magician engaging ghosts, right? Because when we think of ghosts, we think of, priests doing it we think of paranormal hunters doing it we just think of we just think of we just imagine a human in a state of powerlessness engaging the ghost but in the ohm short stories when it comes to horror we want to do a little differently so definitely if you're interested hit the link take it amazon and let me know how you enjoy the story till next time and i appreciate the support by the way till next time peace